The Larrick Saltzman is supposed to be dead. Well, he's not. And he's a vampire thanks to Mother's spell with a white oak stake that can't kill him. He's strong, Nick. D too strong. Bonnie Where's the blood he? bank. She fed him. I had no idea what was happening. Okay, the witches led me there. They wanted him to feed, so he turned. So where's the stake now? Oh, you mean the white oak one? The one that can kill an original and wipe out an entire line of vampires? We don't Much. know. I might have an idea. My mom used a desiccation spell on Michael that immobilized him for over 15 years. If I can get it, I might be able to use it on a lark. If and might, your words inspire such confidence. I'll get it. But even with the spell, we'll need a lot of vampire muscle to take him down. Including yours. Just so we're clear, the sun sets in about eight hours. If we don't succeed before then, Elena will be dead, I'll be gone, and the rest of you will be left to fend for yourselves. It's a shame it's not easier for Elena to see that. I mean, personally, I think she's wasting her time with Damon. You know, all this time and energy you've spent trying to get me and my brother to hate each other. It's actually had the opposite effect. <laughs> Has it? Has it really? Well, then perhaps I should let Elena decide which Salvatore joins us. Being as you and Damon are so close. <sighs> Go for it. Damon and I have been through a hell of a lot worse than you. Each, shall we? I was the one who created your vampire bloodline, therefore I am responsible for your lives. And Tyler's life, Caroline's life, and of course, Abby's life. Should anything go wrong? Or you're just lying to save your ass. I'm not lying. But go ahead, call my bluff. <laughs> I thought I'd taught you better than that. You did. It's okay, it's okay, it's me. Save Elena. You go straight home. You stay inside. Do you understand? Do you understand me? Thank you. Put it down, Elena. Why? Because you still need me alive? There's a reason why Esther used me to make you, isn't there? She didn't want you to be immortal, so she tied your life to a human one. Mine. That way you have only one lifespan to kill all vampires and then you'll be gone. So when I die, you die too. That's it. It has to be. You know, you should be thanking me. I gave you a gift. I took away your misery. You didn't give a crap about me. You just didn't want to be alone. She'll pick one of us. Well, if she chooses you, I'll leave town and let you two be happy and not be bothered by me. And in 60 years, we'll go back to being brothers and none of this will have mattered, right? Yeah. <sighs> Fine. She chooses you, I'll leave town too. All this over one girl. She's a pretty special girl. Yes, she is. A house and its yard turns into a